Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel or if you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Katie If you guys are new you picked a great video to come on to I'm actually gonna be sharing with you guys my entire apartment tour today and I'm very excited for this I know a lot of you guys are excited too So many of you guys literally have been DMing me commenting and asking me to do an apartment tour So I'm really excited to show it to you guys And then also if you guys are interested in any of the pieces that I have in my apartment or any decorations I'm gonna try to link everything down below in the description too so you guys can check that out with that being said Let's just hop right into the video. Okay, so when you very first walk into my apartment, I have this nice long hallway across from my entry door. Um, so as soon as you come in, you just have this nice little coat closet. Honestly, it is a hot mess, so I'm not really going to show you guys, but it's just your standard basic coat closet. And then as soon as you come in, the first door on your left is the bathroom. So of course, there is just the toilet. And then over here, I just have this nice big mirror with a nice big bright light over there. I love the lighting in this apartment. Um, it's really, really nice and bright and white. And then for my sink decorations, I literally just kept it so simple. Um, I just have this soap. This is actually some of my my favorite soap mainly because it was the only one left in the store um, but this one smells amazing and then I just have these little faux flowers and a glass jar and I actually got these from I believe it was Marshall's probably like three or four years ago um, but I've seen people get them recently so I'm sure that they're still there and then down here I just have all of my storage it is pretty tiny for a bathroom um, I actually just recently organized all of this so these cute little white bins are actually from Target and then this little jewelry stand was actually a towel stand um, that I got off of Amazon but I just turned it into a jewelry slash perfume stand and then over here I am absolutely obsessed with this thing it's actually a sunglass holder that I found on Amazon and it was included in my last Amazon haul um, but I turned it into a product shelf and like a product drawer so I have all of my little like hair ties stuff like that in there um, anyways but that's really helpful anyways but yeah so that's just kind of like my bathroom storage I did need a little bit of additional storage so I got three little white bins from Target and just filled those up um, in categories as well and then moving over here this is honestly my favorite part of the bathroom it is a full walk-in shower with glass doors I honestly love how spacious it is like it's really really big for an apartment and then it has a little product rack over here which is really really nice so I don't have to like clutter up the shower floor or anything um, and then I just have my little squeegee that I bought which is honestly the funnest part of taking a shower <laughs> Okay, and then coming right into this next room, I just have my bedroom, and my bed is honestly so plain. I don't know whether I want to get a headboard or not. Um, I definitely want to update my comforter in Dubai, though. But anyway, so I just have all white bedding. I have a little white throw blanket because Kai does sleep on the bed with me, so I always put that down first. And then these two pillows are actually from Amazon. They're in my last Amazon haul video. And then I do just have my bed kind of on like a metal bed frame. And then on the side, again, I do have this huge floor-to-ceiling window. I love going to bed looking at this every night waking up um, and then I do have this really tiny light this is the only one that's in this room so it's always super super dark in here and then in this corner I just have my fan because I always get hot in the middle of the night and then on this whole wall I have just a huge wall just of closet space it's just one consistent closet all the way through my closet is not organized whatsoever so I'm sorry uh, anyways but yeah it is a pretty big closet so on this half I just have all of my clothes shoes up here um, and then just some like storage stuff down here and then on this side is actually where I keep all of my filming equipment. I have more shoes and storage up there. Um, and I just have all of like my filming lights and everything down here. And then coming right over here to this wall, honestly, it's a blank wall. And honestly, there's just not a lot of room between this and the bed, so I don't know what to put here. But I do have this really big clothing rack, so I just ended up putting this here because this is always where I will put out all of my clothes that I am doing for a video. So all of these clothes were for my last Princess Polly partnership. Um, but I like to make sure that they're like all together so I never like miss a clothing and have to like go pull them out of my closet, etc. So this is just where I keep all of those. Um, this is also where I keep like all of my bags that I use frequently and I have like my little backpack over there and then I also keep some of my shoes down here as well. And then coming right out of the bedroom, you do see kind of like an overview to the whole apartment. So on this side, I just have my washer and dryer. They are stackable, which is nice. Saves a lot of room in the apartment. Um, there's Kai. He's always so curious. <laughs> um, and this is just kind of where I store like my ironing board. Not that I ever use it because I have a steamer. Um, and then I have my steam mop down there. I have my like... <laughs> Hi. Um, I have like my dryer sheets, uh, laundry detergent, softener, everything like that. And then this closet is nothing interesting. It's just my water heater and my air filter. And then right across from that on the other side is my kitchen. 
I love my kitchen so much. It's actually a very, very big size for an apartment. It has this huge island. So the first thing when you go into my kitchen, you just have the fridge, um, and then you do have two huge things of storage up above, which is really, really nice. It is just a pretty standard fridge, nothing too exciting. But anyway, so yeah, that is just my fridge. And then coming over on this side, I just have my toaster, and then I also have this little cookie jar. I think I got this one from Marshalls, um, but I just actually keep my coffee grounds in there. And then I have more cabinets down here. I have a nice gas stove I love the stove so much um, it took me a while to get used to cooking on gas as opposed to an electric stove but honestly I love it even better and then over here I just have my little coffee maker and then this cute little jar from Target I actually got this in the three dollar section at Target and then I found these cute little um, fake eucalyptus leaves I love the look of eucalyptus but it's toxic to dogs so obviously I'm not gonna get actual eucalyptus um, but I think that was actually in the Joanna and Gaines section it was like three dollars for each of these so I have that um, and then my little coffee maker so many of you guys ask me why I use such an old-fashioned coffee maker and honestly I like the taste of it better as opposed to like k-cups and stuff um, I've owned a Keurig I've owned an espresso and both of them taste very like plasticky to me I don't know why maybe it's because it's sitting in a plastic cup um, but yeah I like the taste of this coffee a lot better and I just like the smell of fresh brewing coffee in the morning so that's okay we'll be old-fashioned but anyways yeah and then down here I just have more storage I have storage down here at the bottom of my stove too which is really nice um, and then right over here is where I just have Kai's little food and water area. This water bowl is amazing. It's called like a slobber stopper, um, but they actually have to like lick the bottom of the bowl and it doesn't splash, stuff like that. So if you guys have a hardwood floor apartment or house, definitely recommend getting one of these. Like I said, I'll have it linked down below, but this has literally been such a must have so that he doesn't like ruin the floors. And then at the end of the kitchen is one of my absolute favorite things. And I just have this absolutely beautiful view of the city. Um, so it just wraps kind of all the way around there. And then I do have this nice little window down here that you can just pop open. It has a screen in it. So I love that. It's really nice to just get some fresh air into the apartment. And then right across from that window, I have another huge cabinet for storage. Um, there's these really, really cute kind of like hanging lights, which I love the aesthetic of. It's super minimalistic and clean. And then over here, I have this other fake plant and I believe that I got this one from Marshalls too. And then I just have this candle. It's called Fireside. I actually got it at Target, but this is truly the best smelling candle ever. Um, I feel like a lot of candles smell like kind of like toxic and stuff like that, but this one is just such a nice, like subtle, clean smell. And then I just have my sink over here and then it has just storage all down at the bottom. And then wrapping around to the other side of the island I have these gorgeous white stools I used to have gray ones here but honestly I love the white even better um, they have a really nice like glossy shine to them they are metal and then over here I just kind of have my little charging station so I have all of like my camera chargers my Alexa um, I have like more charging stuff down there and then coming over here we kind of start to get into my living room area um, so I just have this huge mirror from Ikea by the way that's a fire alarm so many of you guys always ask whenever I post like mirror pictures or something um, um, anyways, that's what that is. But I have this huge mirror from Ikea. This was definitely one of like the best purchases I could have made. I love this thing. It's such nice quality. Also, in case you guys wanted to know, because I feel like I always get questions, um, my oversized t-shirt is from H&M. These shorts are from Princess Polly. And then my jewelry is from Princess Polly too. Um, and I'll link these for you guys too. But anyways, random, beside the point. But so yeah, I just have this huge giant mirror. This is where all my selfies are taken, everything like that. And then coming right across from the mirror, I just have my TV. I'm actually going to end up mounting this I just haven't gotten around to it because um, right now like it's not on a stand or anything it's just kind of like sitting there um, but anyway so that's fine and then for the TV stand it's actually the mom dresser from Ikea and like you guys kind of saw my bedroom is pretty tiny and so I didn't like the dresser in my bedroom so I just moved it out here and doubled it as a TV stand which works really well and it totally matches my aesthetic so I'm totally fine with it I definitely want to get a different decoration for this side um, I just haven't really I don't know what I want to put there yet um, but right now I just kind of have like a bowl of sunglasses super random but easy to grab and then over here I just have my Bible and then I have a little candle from Target as well and then in this corner I have a tripod lamp from Target and I really really like this one um, the cord does come out through the leg which is really nice and I like that it's like a stainless steel color a lot of them that I found were like gold which I didn't want because my apartment is more cool toned um, but I actually found this one for like 60 bucks on Amazon which was awesome and then over here I just have this plant from Ikea both the plant and the pot and the little watering jug are all from Ikea as 
well. And then over here, I just have Kai's little toy basket. He has way too many toys, definitely does not need that many, um, but that's just kind of how I keep them. And then coming right across from my TV, I just have my little living room area. I love my little living room so, so much. I actually, for a long time, debated whether I wanted to spend more money and get like a big sectional or if I should just get like a like three-seater because it's only me that lives here. But I am so glad that I went for this couch. Um, I believe this one was actually $1,000 from Ikea. So for a five-seater sectional, that's really not that bad. So down here, I just have this faux fur rug and this is actually from Amazon. Um, and I think it was maybe under like, maybe it was like $150 or so. Um, anyways, but yeah, it's honestly such good quality. It's machine washable. Um, right now I just have it turned diagonal just with the way that I wanted my living room to be set up. But yeah, such a great quality rug. It's actually really easy to clean and dog's hair does not stick to it as much, which is really, really nice. You can just shake it out and everything comes out. I was definitely worried about getting an all white rug considering that I have a dog and he walks outside all the time. Um, but no, it's like super easy to clean. And then for my coffee table, it's actually just this little basket with a lid from Ikea and it's really nice because I just like to throw like any extra pillows or blankets stuff like that in there um, just to kind of keep the place tidy and that way everything is not just out and messy um, so I love this one it's super easy to clean and it was really inexpensive and then on my coffee table I have another one of these little flowers from Marshall's and then underneath it I just have my little devotional book that I read on the couch every morning and then over here we have Kai and I have this blanket here because he always lays on the couch in the spot and as you guys can see he likes to like lay his head that way and then just look out at the city, look at the people, um, all the dogs walking by. So that's like his favorite place to lay. Kai, say hi. <laughs> How you doing, bub? <laughs> um, but anyways, this blanket I actually, I believe, got from, I think maybe Target. It's a huge blanket. It's really soft and comfy. It's like a knit material. Um, and then over here, I just have these pillows. This one's from Target. This is also from Target. Um, this one is actually from Amazon. I just showed this in my last Amazon haul. And then over here, I always leave this extension cord over here. It's nice and like white and just really tiny. But I actually have this plugged in back at my desk area, which I will show you guys in a second. Um, but I really like having that so that I can just be charging my phone or charging my laptop if I need to. But I like that it's a little bit more like aesthetically pleasing extension cord rather than like the outdoor ones and stuff. Um, so I love that one. And then moving over here, this is just another pillow that I got from Amazon. And then coming from the back of my couch, if you move right over here, this is actually kind of like my little desk office area. And I love the placement of this because it's kind of like my own tiny nook, um, but there's still like plenty of room to like move around. And then over here, I just have this cute little drawing of Kai that someone did on Instagram. And then over here, I have my huge, huge calendar. It's the full 12 months. And this is so helpful just to like plan out all of my day and my content and uh, partnerships, everything like that. Um, and then I just have my laptop right here. And then this chair is also from Ikea. I really like just like the clear white acrylic look. And then it just has nice little silver legs. And I'm not gonna lie, I actually really like this chair because it's kind of bouncy. So when I get bored, I just sit there and bounce in my chair like a five-year-old, but I'm very like ADD, so. And then over here, I just have this cute little marble coaster. I really like this one. Again, I think I got it from Marshalls. And then I just have some more fake flowers. Um, fake flowers I actually got off Amazon. And then this vase, I believe I got from Target. I'm not 100% sure. It was years ago. And then I just have my big filming camera because it doesn't fit in one of these drawers. And then down here, I just have my printer. I have all of my lenses and other camera equipment back there. And then all around my living room, I have these huge floor to ceiling windows. It's so gorgeous to see the sunrise over. And then at nighttime when all the city lights come on, it's just so, so pretty. But yeah, so that is just kind of a quick little overview of my apartment. Okay guys, so that was it for the tour. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and I will catch you in my next video. Bye guys!